Welcome everyone back to another Life with Feet vlog with Tisha. I'm here in my art studio and I want to say that I have really been working hard on making this space uh, a really good one for me. I'm really happy with the way that it's been turning out. I've got my books set up and I've been pulling out some little pieces of uh, uh, items that I want to put in here to display and even though it's still not quite exactly where I want it to be I am completely happy with the way that it is turning out. Now I do want to say that I want to apologize for not being able to post for the past two weeks. I have been having a really hard time with my legs since I need hip surgery. I've been sluggish and slow on doing just the simple mundane things in life which means that you know doing vlogs and making videos has kind of taken a back seat and on top of that Jared and I have started uh, well we bought a whole bunch of new furniture for the house and we took all of the old furniture out which means that our bedroom looks like this that's right, it is bare, it's clean, there's nothing in there except for the mattress and Jared's dresser. Unfortunately, our furniture hasn't come in yet, even though we ordered it like a month ago. Uh, we're still waiting for a couple of pieces to come in. But with that said, uh, my office is starting to look like this. <laughs> It has become a place where things are just thrown uh, when we don't know where to put them. And I've, I'm trying as hard as I can to organize that space and my art studio and keep the house clean, all while my leg is not uh, cooperating with me. For the past two weeks, I've been looking for my camera batteries and my chargers uh, for my camera. I have all of these great ideas on vlogs that I wanted to do, but with all of the mix-up and everything being misplaced, I couldn't find one or all three of these items at a time, and it just made it really difficult to, um, to sit down and actually start vlogging. But with that said, I wanted to share with you um, a little bit of my art studio. So over here I've got my painting station where uh, my brother made this desk for me from Ikea and I've got all of my painting stuff on it and my fine liners and watercolors and stuff. And then I've got this pegboard which I'm working on putting things on. Um, things that I want available but also out of the way. And then... As I move over to the other side of the room, I've got a bookshelf back there that's just got a bunch of miscellaneous stuff on it. And I've got my easel tucked away in the corner. My favorite part right now is my little bookshelf that has all of my little decorative uh, books and hand lettering and anything about typography. Up above, I have my uh, sketchbooks. I have a lot of them and a little stuffed toy that I need to keep away from the dogs because they will try to destroy her. And then on the next shelf over here, I've got all my pencils and colored pencils, brushes, a little tote to keep some miscellaneous stuff in. And then moving down, some random stuff. And then my desk that has, um, not much on it right now, but this is the desk that I will be using for my oil paintings. And then a little bit over here, I've got uh, a cabinet with some palettes on it, my backpack for school, another camera set up. Now that I have all my batteries and chargers, I can have that. I like that I can just keep that there in the corner. It's out of the way, and whenever I need it, I can just pull it out, which is good. Jack has his own little couch in here. Yeah, so when I'm either painting or doing some vlogs, uh, he can just chill out with me and sit on his little chair. That is the door to the garage, so no one really comes in or out of there. I can keep it locked. 
Uh, and then I've got a little coat hook to keep my purses and my hats on it. And then over here is probably like one of my favorite little spaces when I'm either done painting or, you know, just want to take a rest. I can sit on my little couch area, which is really cute and pink, and I've got a blanket to go over it. And then in front of that, I've got a small TV that I can sit and chill. And then my trunk uh, is here. It's got some stuff that I don't need readily available, but uh, paperwork and stuff that I need to keep with me. We got a little tote back behind there, and then circling back around, one of my art studio lights um, for vlogging. If I need a little bit more extra light in here, I can just pop that up and get that going. Yeah. So. That's a quick tour of my space. And I'm really happy with the way that it's turning out. I just need to put a couple of things away and then I will be good to go. I like that I have a space to keep my camera set up and ready to go so that when I do want to start filming, I don't need to unpack it from its case and you know set it up and put it on the tripod. It's just ready there for me and I just have to press the record button so hopefully that'll make things a lot more easier to start filming and doing some things. Plus, I am also setting up a space where I can hang my GoPro from the top of my art table, which means that I'll be able to record a lot of my art paintings. So I'm super excited about that and I can't wait to, uh, to share with you some of those. Um, yeah, this experience has really shown me like how I want to organize things, how I like things set up. So I'm taking a lot of the things that I'm learning down here and I'm taking them upstairs so that when I do really need to start uh, getting rid of things and putting things away, uh, I've got a really good system going on. So I'm really happy about that. And with the new furniture coming in, it's like a clean slate and just putting things away and making sure that they stay put is, uh, it's going to be really good and I'm excited about that. Okay, so that's all that I have for you today. I'm glad that you guys were here to join me and uh, that I was able to share with you my new little art studio, even though it's got some work to do. Uh, if you like this video, hit the subscribe button, ring the bell, and join us for next week. We've got a whole bunch of exciting stuff that's going on that uh, Jessica and I want to share with you. Okay, thank you. Bye.